good YouTube, welcome back to another sneaker review of Sneak On Feet 360. Today we're showing you guys the Retro 7 Raptor. Straightforward shoe. I believe this is the second time they retroed it. So we have different version, we have the OG. I believe this is the second time and then we have the one similar to the Raptor. Which is the one he plays against the Raptor and then scores 68 points. Um, it's in the house, I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna do like a comparison with it later on. But that is the Countdown Pack 7 that I have. So right here we got these uh, finish line and I forgot the release date but it says right here your order is for Sunday September 2nd um, I'm gonna cover up the address okay so it says right here your order Sunday September 2nd 2012 then retro 7 eight and a half and then 59 tax 12 Everything totals up to 177. We got these at finish line. Okay. See right there. And it's cool the finish line they give you a box on their own. Shipping box. This is finish line right there. They did do a double box, but the thing is that it still got messed up in here a little bit. The dog in the background man. <laughs> Hope it's not too loud for you guys. I'll try and talk louder though. Okay, so size six and eight. I mean size eight and a half. Ed Jordan Retro 7. And the official colorway is uh, black. Uh, what does it say? Dark charcoal. Uh, what the heck is that? And yeah. Okay. Um, box price 160. And this is the new Jordan box ever since the Retro 12 playoff, I believe. Here go, we have the shoe right here. I'm gonna do a quick sniff test. So bear with me for a little bit. It smells good, man. It smells like, you know, a Jordan should smell. New pair of J's. You already know where it is. Out. And the thing I like about these is that it comes with the round laces, okay? Um, so we have front view, so we have 360 view of the shoe like always. Front view of the shoe. Right side of the right shoe. This is the back of the heel. You see that purple pull tab sticking up? This is the left side of the left shoe. We are back to the front. And we have an additional view of uh, bottom up, I mean bottom down, top view down. And finally, the outsole or the bottom sole. Crazy artwork right there. Okay. I'd like to show you guys the sole because then, you know, it's the thing I like about the shoe. It's the sole. I believe that it has its own story. Okay. So we're going to get straight into the shoe. The shoe features a black suede, um, round laces. And uh, you know, just purple, black on black, purple, some some of that red, some of that violet. And the sole right here is very, very sick. Okay. This is the design of the Retro 7. And see that sole right there? It's an orange. See that orange part? Very nice. Take this off. It's getting dark. But yeah. Okay. So just pretty much straightforward. Sway. And this is the part that I like. You see this letter right here? It has a different color. It has like nice quality right here. Nice quality. You see that um, letter? It looks somewhat similar to that Retro 6 infrared, like the OG one back in the days. Okay, very soft suede. Not as soft as the, what is it? Um, the Retro 6 infrared, but this is kind of like, it's not really suede. It's kind of mixed between Nubuck and suede. Like the retro form my brother's wearing right now. Okay, it's kind of like new buck right here. This is from the countdown pack, so they have a similarity right there. But this is fading. Okay, so now just straightforward round laces. That's cool. They're bringing that back. Black on black. Um, reddish jump in on the side, and this is the design of the retro seven. It comes with. Um, you know, some leather lining in here on the sock liner. Okay, 
and now this it comes with like a second cushioning mesh okay the design is in here okay it's around the whole shoe on the inside okay and I'd like to call this like a second layer you know your second soft layer kind of thing so this is the pull tab in the back uh, violet or purple okay, tap up this is the the highlight of the shoe I like to call it okay so now this is the back of it 23 facing that direction in red and that triangle iconic triangle on the retro 7 same thing and here on the side we have a violet hit glossy paint and then this is coming from the um, bottom layer the bottom sole of the shoe I like to call this um, that cheddar cheese print you see those crater right there somewhat similar to the one on the moon okay now yeah so red and violet and then this is the black missile soft right there soft foamy and uh, same thing over here and that's about it like you know just simple straightforward shoe mesh right here mesh very soft the whole tongue this whole tongue goes all the way down here and then it switches right here these holes right here are for ventilation okay from here up it's mesh and then from down here down it's kind of like mesh but a little bit harder than this up here for comfort and then uh, red air jordan stitching okay you got your size tag in the back size tag in the back size eight and a half there and the insole is black with a red jump in okay black with a red jump in i don't know y'all can see it right there but yeah okay and that is it for the shoe you can tell like all these design they are kind of like a branch out from the retro 6 i'm gonna do a side by side comparison with that also but yeah we're gonna do it on feet and all that so thanks for watching and i'll be right back so i'm back to show you guys a side by side comparison of my countdown pack uh supposedly seven raptor and the retro of the the, the original raptor right here okay so just straightforward look at them Pretty much the same colorway but this is like a little bit brighter this is a little bit darker or maybe this is fading i forgot okay now right away you can tell that the difference like that you can tell the difference right away looking at it see that uh, silver grayish grayish color right there blend in with the black and then this is uh, versus this this is black on black so now on the back pretty much same thing on the back just um this is the countdown and it has like a little bit darker color Okay, and now on the back of this tongue, it has the score point. It says March um, 4, 1993. He scored 64 points against the Raptor. And uh, everything else is just the same. But then look at the tongue right here real quick. Just slight difference. Because this is, it has like a gray and black. And this kind of like all gray. Uh, lighter color again. And then this... Um, this part right here, this is new buck. Okay, this black part is new buck versus this. Everything is new buck, and then this gray part, this way. Okay, and um, look at the bottom sole real quick. A little bit darker because you know it's fading, and everything's almost the same except for this part right here, the orange, and this is purple. So they switch that out. Let's see if we can spot anything else. That's about it. So I'm gonna show you the six real quick. So I'm gonna show you guys the retro six and the retro seven similarity. And you can see right there. See all these line and design. Pretty much came from the retro six. But six, it has a sharper um, corners or shape of it, and they have like a much more defined pattern. Okay. This is the six infrared uh, package. So see, it has more lines, more pattern versus this this is sharper and this is more dull and see that you can still see that this shape is coming from the six now the bottom sole the front is also from the six the front missile right here somewhat similar see on the side now the bottom sole uh, a little bit similarity but this is bigger quite bigger more narrower and yeah that's about it so you two i'm back to show you guys the shoe on feet 360 on my left is going to be the Raptor from the Countdown Pack. On my right is going to be the Raptor, the new one that we're doing. 
And this is again, this is the colorway, the Raptor theme, um, purple and red. So we have front wheel to shoe. Okay, front wheel to shoe. This is the right from the Raptor that we're doing right now. This is black on black, and then this is the back. I noticed the lace tip is different. It has that metallic uh, finish, but it's not metal. It's a uh, plastic chrome. So back to the left. This is the uh, Raptor countdown pack. And this is the front. And real quick, I'm gonna show you guys the sole from the back view. Very dope and clean shoe. This feels as though they're way uh, more comfort, more comfortable versus the new Raptor, which is normal because the newer they are, the less comfort they are nowadays. And you gotta pay more. So that's the thing about JB Jordan Brand. Okay. I'm gonna do a jump test. See the mirror right there. Um soft landing. Soft landing. Yeah, good ankle support. Okay, thanks for watching. Um, just make sure you guys rate, comments, and subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next video. I'm not sure what's coming. We was gonna do two video today, but um, we got something came up, and um. We just got home from River LA, picking up a birthday present for our friend. And we'll try and do next video on the Retro 4 Cavaliers, as well as the Military Blue and the Red and White. Or the Mars Black in addition, but it's not with the logo. And we'll try and do it at like another location, something like that. Not behind our backyard or in the hallway. And yeah, thanks for watching.